Um, I think that the school's in good shape. Um, I, I'm hoping that it's in good shape, but there is work that we need to do. So we're just going to make sure that everything is covered that needs to be covered. Armani goes to the Luton school. This one. She and her sister, Rakea, are getting excited. Which Their new baby it? brother, or sister, is expected in a few days' time. Like While Salafi Muslims plan the best future for themselves and their children, they also prepare themselves for the end of the world. They believe that the day of judgment is close at hand. So what do the signs include? Now the signs are separated into two categories, the minor signs of the day of judgment and the major signs. As far as the Muslims are concerned, most of the minor signs, if not all, have already appeared. Uh, and not in any particular order, they indicate uh, changes of practices uh, in the whole world and the community. For example, uh, the signs indicate that there will be an increase in fornication and adultery uh, in the world before the Day of Judgment. And we see that now in, in the institutions of marriage breaking down, not only in the West, but that's also spreading to traditionally conservative countries like the Arab countries and uh, Asian countries. Also, uh, uh, there's a saying that, uh, of the Prophet Islam that the women will be uh, dressed but naked um, and this was a hard concept for the people of the time to understand but if we look at uh, the forms of dress that certain women do wear nowadays mini skirts or uh, you know, other uh, see-through tops etc this is another indication of one of the signs of the day of judgment but what are Muslim men supposed to do if they see an attractive woman in the street well the, the ideal for a Muslim man and for any Muslim really is when you walk you should walk with your gaze down, you know, and it's, it's wrong. I, I won't say that nobody would ever look at the girl. They may even look at her, but you can look once and that's a look. But then if you stare, then that's something else. Yeah. So as a Muslim man, if I'm walking down the street and that situation occurs and I do see the girl, then the ideal for me is to look away is to look down on the ground and, and just carry on walking. And there's some famous companions of the Prophet, peace be upon him, who, this was their nature, this was their habit. When they used to walk the streets of Mecca, when they used to walk the streets of Medina, they would